You're back. I'm here, aren't I? Hmm. I'm glad. How long has it been? Since what? Since the last time we've seen each other. Well, let's see. January, February, two months. Seems a hell of a lot longer to me. Oh, by the way, uh, you know those phone calls you were getting last month? Uh, they'd ring and you'd answer and they'd hang up? Uh-huh. Well, that was me. I just had to hear the sound of your voice. So what's it been like here? Well, I've been... I'm so, I don't mean to cut you short, baby. It's just I'm so happy. No, I've been going through hell without you. You know, you and I argue about the stupidest things, but never again. Now that I've got you, I'm going to never let you go. And that's a promise, baby. Mickey, being so nice. And that's the way I'm going to be from now on. Forever and ever and ever. <laughs> feel my heart. Feel it. Fast, ain't it? Uh-huh. Well, let me feel yours. Uh-huh. Just as I thought, just like my a mile a minute. Must be love. Honey, I want you to know that the um, last few times we talked on the phone, I didn't mean any of that. You know that, don't you? I thought you hated me. I, I was just bluffing. I just wanted you to think I hated you. All I felt was, what do I do now? I was angry at you. Listening to you was just so frustrating. But I never stopped loving you. I'm a little surprised. <laughs> I've never seen you so sweet before. This is going to be a happy birthday after all. Whoa. Is that why you stopped by? You remembered my birthday. Now tell me in your own words. And I promise I won't interrupt. Well, <clears throat> yesterday I was talking to Yolanda Waxman. Do you remember her? Yeah. Okay. I was telling her about this really sad Rod Stewart song, and we're looking through my albums, and I can't find it. And then I remember it's not an album, it's a tape. And I left all my tapes over here. So I came by and picked it up, and I found it. See? That's why you came by? Oh, and guess what else? When I was going through my records, I found one of your Elvis Presley albums. And I knew you couldn't live without that, so I dropped it off. God, this place looks so empty without my stuff. I bet she left you some of my plants. What's that? It's toilet flushing. Man! Whew. Talk about dropping a cheese bone. <laughs> Wouldn't go in there about an hour past you. Oliver, darling, come over here. Oliver, I want you to meet one of my oldest friends, Mickey. Mickey, this is one of my newest friends, Oliver Brandon. Hi, guy. How the hell did you get in here? You gave me your key. Well, Ollie got us in. Yeah, I hope you don't mind, guy. You know, I, the old credit card in the lock routine. Had to get Sugar here, her Rod Stewart. I see you like Elvis, huh? Yeah, that's nice, that's nice. I got an aunt that likes Elvis. Oliver's a really great actor. You should talk, you're pretty great yourself. I'm not. You are. I'm not. You are. You're better. No, I'm not. You are. No, I'm not. You are so. Don't believe a word he says. He's really glorious. Oh, I'm so stupid. I forgot to tell you the most exciting news. I got a part in a play. It's the Torrance Community Theater production of Godspell. That's where I met Oliver. Tell him what part you play. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> well, look, we got to go, you know. Uh, we got to go to that thing tonight. What thing? You know, that big thing that we have to go to, and we're late now, so we, we better get a move on. Okay, whatever. Bye, Mickey. Call me up sometime, and soon we'll talk. It's, it's time, and we have to have to go. Okay. Godspell opens on the 19th. I'll leave you a ticket at the door, you know, so you can get in free to see me. Later, guy. Did you used to have a scene with that guy? 
a little one. Except for me, he's got really good taste. And now there's you. Boy, you know who's shaking his head? You know something? You shoot a game of pool, you like good music, and you got a really cool name. How'd you like to go out to a party? Sure. You would? Sure. Oh, this is, this is kismet. This is just fantastic. Okay. I got a best friend. It's his birthday today. And if that's at all possible, I'd like to set you up. You see, he's just the best guy that there is in the world. And I'd only set him up with somebody who's like really cool like you. You think you might be interested in something like that? Oh, yeah, this is great. Oh, this is, you know, the, I'm, I'm reeling here. Oh, this is just fantastic. Okay, I'll tell you what. Uh, you got kind of something in a... Oh, I have a lip liner. We can oh, okay. that. Oh, that's no problem. I can get my last penny with mine. You want to use those? Yeah, I'm going to use down here. What do you write? Uh, his address. Now, just go there and entertain him. You know, show him a good time. Okay. All right? You then he'll play back in How am I going to get in? Oh, okay, let me get you. You got you. Yeah, we're best friends. We have three things in this place. Okay. Now, the thing is, when you get through, you talk him into coming over. Okay. All right, and he knows the, he knows the directions. I got a little group thing set up for be me and you and, and him and uh, my girlfriend. And we'll have a nice little party, okay? Great. Oh, this is great. Should we talk price now or later? Come again? Um, price, you know, my price. Oh, your price! Yeah. Price, 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 price. <laughs> yeah. Boy, this is kind of stupid today. Okay, um, sure, uh, how, how much? Well, uh, how much do you think? Well, uh, how much do you usually charge? Well, how much do you usually pay? Uh, uh, usually the going rate is what I usually pay. The going rate. Oh, well, see, I I'm not a whore. I'm, I'm a call girl, and call girls, well, they're a lot more classier. Oh, I knew that. I knew that when I came over here that you were a call girl. I mean, you are not a whore, and I would never, ever even think about getting a whore for for Mickey, because he's the best, and you're, you know, you're class. Really? Yes. That, really? That, that's the honest to God's truth. They no lie in the honest engine. Okay, then how about, um... Forty! Thirty! Forty! 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 Okay, I'll go forty. You go forty? Forty-two. Okay, I'll pay for it. Okay. Okay. Where's okay. the money? Okay, uh... Whoa! 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 handle this fuck. I can't deal with that guy anymore. Wait, do you have to say fuck in front of the customer? Wait, does it sound better coming out of your mouth, huh? It's all right coming out of a man's mouth. Am I right about it? You've heard the word before, haven't you, buddy? haven't noticed. It's a new age. I can say anything hey, you can say. Hey, hey, hey. Just bump my ass. Make, get me off. Get me off. <laughs> you know, so, when, so I, thought I, heard, I heard once the marriage starts, the romance is done. No, no, not so. Not so. Tell him, right, honey? Huh? It's still going strong. Am I right? I love her. I love her. She wasn't good in the set. Fuck, I'd be out of here in two minutes, you know? I want the coolest looking cake you got there, eh? Oh, my cakes are cool. Come on. I want that one. You want the one with the, the, the arm? With the, the, with the squiggly, squiggly, the squiggly and, the, and the little <laughs> things on them. Okay. Right. That's the one for Mickey. Nothing but the best for Mickey, and I want that one. I got news for you. It's delicious, okay? Three threes. Three what? Three threes. Three, huh? Yeah, you're gonna write on that for me, won't you? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna write on it, Clarence. Give me a chance, huh? Give me a chance to get it ready. Not the greatest box, but it's I a box, right? I just need to take, I just I mean, need to I take it home. Boxes, I'm gonna okay? give it to him, not in the box. I'm gonna give it to him. Can't, can't you know, I was thinking. I was thinking about something. You know, it's it's been something that's really been bothering me. And, I mean, it's not like I don't disagree with you. I mean, as, as as a singer, Elvis. I mean, as a performer with albums and recordings. 